Good afternoon, guys, and happy July 16th. We are starting off the vlog in Logan Sport, doing some errands, shopping, that sort of stuff. We just got done at Walmart, and now we are at Rural King to get some chicken food. So we could feed the chickens. Oh, yep. They're hungry. Yeah, they need some food. Mm -hmm. Is it just me, or does this Jeep look angry? This Jeep is mad. Yes. Do you want to do it? <laughs> Got me. Next stop is Home Depot. We've got to get some light covers, light switch covers and outlet covers for our house and we're gonna look at a new oven. Fourteen. We're replacing all of the covers in our house and it's quite flat. Chopping off the chicken feed at my parents' house. Nice. I'm gonna go check chicken, see if they need fat. Okay. Hello. Good digging the house. Hi, chickens. <laughs> Straight digging holes. Hello. Did you guys lay eggs yet? You can't come out until you lay eggs. Yeah, so if you're wondering why they're still in the cage, it's the middle of the day and we haven't let them out for the past like two days because they're getting to the age now where we they should be laying eggs soon and my mom is concerned she doesn't want them to learn to lay eggs like out in the yard <laughs> she wants them to lay eggs in here so while they're still in that early stage of learning then we need to keep them in here until they figure out that this is where they lay eggs and then after that we will let them out any eggs yeah okay. i don't see any eggs in here do you no eggs they'll work on it sorry guys Figure out how to lay eggs and then you can come out. Oh my goodness. <laughs> that one got all floofy. Sarah, will you be cameraman for us? Thanks. Hi fans. So I don't know what Danielle's told you and what she hasn't told you yet because sometimes she forgets to record besides the point. But today on the vlog, we are um, sprucing up the apartment which Trevor and Danielle are living in. So I'm sitting outside supervising the most important job of this whole, whole ordeal. So um, right now I don't know exactly what you would call what we're doing but I'll just kind of show you. Alright look oh, there's my hot mama and this is the telehandler. My dad's in there driving. I don't know if you can hear me, so I'll speak up a little louder. But they're using this fork telehandler and the piece of wood to push those stairs back up because they've fallen down because the house is a little, um, well, I don't know how to put this, but this apartment is well used, if you know what I mean. And so, um, since they've been moving in, they've Trevor and Danielle have been trying to spruce it up a bit and it does look a lot nicer so we're just doing a little more um, sprucing. Editing Danielle here. I just thought I'd jump in and say a little bit more about what Sarah's trying to say. But basically our house has been, like she said, well lived in. And part of us moving here and into this place was to make it better and we've been working really hard to do that. And what they're doing in these clips is the stairs 
of our like front porch area has been leaning. There's a there used to be a giant crack in between the stairs, and that was because like water would run in there and then it would freeze and expand and that's how like cracks come to be in concrete normally. And so there was like a gap like this wide in between like the patio area and the stairs area. So during the day, mom and I scraped out all of the dirt and crud that had gotten in that crack. And then now we're using the forklift to push the stairs back to where that goes. And then my dad is gonna hammer concrete or push concrete underneath the stairs so that way it holds in that spot. So I'll just uh, keep the camera on the action. He's ripping up my flower that just bloomed. No, I hope it's okay. Oh no, he's taking my flowers out. <laughs> he's shoving concrete under there, trying to level the stairs out. We've got the telehandler pushing it up against the house so that way it's flush right there you used to have a big crack like this wide right in between there so we've got to push we're adding concrete and we're getting it more leveled out hi hi it's air conditioned in here uh -huh. <laughs> you lucky duck <laughs> okay, bye. Who do you think did all the work here? Look at this sweaty, dirty monster. It was, it me. was me. Oh yeah, you guys me. did it. Me. Oh yeah. Me. Yeah. In my white shirt. <laughs> so this is the finished product. Trevor did the worst job. Hold, hold the pedal. He had to hold the foot brake. He had toe cramp the whole time. No more crack here. Put concrete down in this crack that we then made. And then we replanted my flower, so it's still here. She can come out. And now we are celebrating with wine and pizza. <laughs> and and Skye, who's really angry. She wants to come out. 369, pizza and wine. Check it, check it, check it for me one more time. Below, 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 below. For the pizza, to the wine, to the wine. Sipping all the dog. <laughs> okay, now we're Bondo in the railing. And they gotta work fast or else it dries real quick and gets hard. <laughs> it's getting dark, but the boys are still out here working. Give me a thumbs up, Trevor. Very nice. And Mom and I are sitting in the lawn chairs, just chilling watching them work and that's it for today's vlog make sure you guys stay tuned for more house updates and more updates on how everything looks when it's all done we have big things coming i'm super excited we're going to eventually get new carpet we are going to get a new stove this place is going to look so cute and then maybe we'll give you guys a nice little house tour of it all updated so if you like this video make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe to us on youtube if you haven't already and follow us on facebook it'll all be linked in the description and we'll see you guys next time bye Boop.